when somebody like mocks me when I bring something up. So if I say, hey, I'm gonna do door-to-door -door sales, I'm gonna make $100,000 and be a millionaire or something, right? Everybody's gonna laugh at you. Or if you say, hey, this digital piece of art, I think that will be worth money, Yeah. right? And I was like, well, that doesn't make any sense, right? Yeah. But the moment I feel this pushback, there's a certain level of uncomfort that makes me ask questions why. Well, why are you uncomfortable with me knocking door to door? Or why are you uncomfortable with me putting money into an NFT. Right. And so these disruptive spaces allow me to ask questions. And I go, okay, man, All let's right. start doing this. Let's okay. buy this taxi it drives in the metaverse and makes me poke it up. <laughs> <laughs> what, that ape, he's kind of melty. Oh, it's worth more because he's melting. Okay. <laughs> like everything didn't make any sense. And that made a lot of sense to me because then when I dove into the utility and the potential and the right. long term of it, then I started thinking, okay, maybe this is the future of how we're going to do digital contracts. This is the future of how you're going to buy a house. I think there's a lot of future utility with NFTs.